babes. It's your girl Joy back with another Basil Bingo. It is Vlogmas Day 6. I tried to throw in some stripe. Not really fancy today and I got my red chucks back on. <sighs> it, I'm back on my lunch break. But it was weird. Well, not so weird. We have a lot of Christian teachers at this school. And today, I'm gonna really try to get these vlogs a little shorter. My last one was long. I apologize, but it was my it was my whole day. <laughs> I was like, but and I did cut out quite a bit. But I just wanted to jump on here very quickly because you know I only got 30 minutes. I did go to the bathroom. I did go to the bathroom, so that was five of my minutes right there. Cause then I'm trying to weave and dodge, weave and dodge, 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 dodge through the sea of children that's walking towards their classes, excitedly walking towards their classes. <laughs> that's what all teachers would love to think. So, um, one of the alts, I don't know, supervisors here, a really, really cool guy, and he called me on the telephone in the middle of the class. He was like, "Hey, what's up?" You know, and it's a speaker. I don't know how it works. So it's a speaker. I'm like, yes. <laughs> so in the middle of class, hold on. I'm like, hold on. I'll be with y'all in a minute. Calm down. Calm down. Hold on. Class quiet. I'm like, yes. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. The spicy chicken sandwich. Uh-huh. Okay. Yeah. And some coleslaw. Okay. Uh-huh. Is it your treat? Okay. Yeah. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. No, I don't need anything to drink. Thank you. Uh-huh. All right. Yeah. Ah. Okay. All right. Okay. All right. Okay. Okay. Thank you. I appreciate it. Why are you doing this? Why are you buying me lunch? What you need? You need some? Because I ain't got no money. I brought my lunch. I brought more Thanksgiving dinner. Okay. All right, then. I appreciate that. I appreciate that. Okay. All right. All right, bye-bye. Okay, thank you. <laughs> That's exactly how... I'm sorry, kids. I'm sorry. I, I apologize. So anyway, as we were saying, a truism is a statement that is obviously true. Yes. Do you get that? Not the literal definition of the picture or... Don't give me the... Li yes, I see the kids crying. That's literal. But dig deeper. What do you think it really means? Give me the theme or the overall life message, but it needs to be true. If you're describing the picture, then it is not a truism. Do you got that? <laughs> that has been my day. And I got me a spicy chicken sandwich. He's got, he's really, really cool. He's a Christian. And he said, I pray for you. I said, I need financial abundance. And, you know, so he prayed for a couple of uh, teachers. We, you know, we wrap in, in the hallway at the end of the day. Oh, man, the highlight of my day really is the very, very end of my day. Catching the sixth graders running down the hallway. I'm like, oh, 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 oh. We don't run in the hallway. That is a brisk walk. I like that walk. <laughs> it is truly the highlight of my day. And I missed it yesterday. So, anyway. So when we were in the hallway, so at the end of the day, we just talk in the hallway and you know, so he has a broken foot and we said, we're going to pray for quick healing when you foot. And he, he said, well, what do you need me to pray for? I'll pray for you. Another lady said her ankle and attendance and another lady said something else. And I said, look, financial abundance. That's what I need. Financial abundance. <laughs> he said, okay, I got you. But as much as given, is something received. I don't know, you gotta give to receive. I was like, look, I got like $2 in my account. I can't give nothing else. He was like, no, no. Remember the lady, she made $10 million. She only had $5 baking those cakes. <laughs> so somebody else was telling the story <laughs> about somebody. So I said all of that to say, I'm about to munch on my Popeyes. I thought that was so sweet of him. That was the sweetest thing. It was so sweet, and I said, I gotta have it with some coleslaw. So he got me some coleslaw to go with it. Child, can I turn this into a lunch mukbang? Y'all don't wanna see me eat, though. I know y'all don't wanna see that. So, I don't know what I'm gonna do this evening for Vlogmas. I wanted to put up a tree, so I'm not sure what's gonna happen. Uh, Bobby has basketball, my daughter. My daughter's name is Bobby. So, I don't know. I don't know. But 
I would say this is Vlogmas. This is a beautiful gift and gifts come in all different ways. So should this just be day six? Let this be day six and we'll see when we get home. We'll see what happens. So because I, um, I'm not sure what's gonna happen. I like to put my coleslaw, okay, so let's make it up, but my seat is not low enough, so that's that's what happens. When your seat's not low enough for the mukbang, you can't get the food in. But then I have stuff to do. Okay, I don't have the right seat, guys. So, I don't have the right seat, because your seat needs to be low. So, but honey, I like to put my coleslaw on the sandwich. Look, that's good. I can't. Mm -mm. Let me see. Look at that bite, guys. So I would say this has been an amazing gift to be treated uh, to lunch. And that's the little coleslaw that I put on there. Yes, I need my nails done. Like I said, financial abundance. Financial abundance, okay? Mm. good y'all all right I need to create a quick thumbnail oh lord how many minutes I got left y'all Eleven fifty-six. Mm, I got about 18 minutes and that's what we do we rush our food, so it's not like you can really sit down and enjoy, save your food, decompress, get ready for the next classroom. You yeah. can't. Every day is a big rush. Then on top of that, as usual, I wasn't too sure what I was going to be teaching because I'm trying to stay on track. Came up with something last minute. They actually had to finish or continue working on what they were doing yesterday. And I kind of threw in the new lesson, but I didn't want to inundate them. It's like, woo, this is a big lesson. So I made it fun and they didn't realize we were learning stuff. They were learning truisms. So, and then here comes the big boys coming to observe my class, y'all. Mm-hmm. And honey, let me tell you something. If you come into my classroom to observe, include you in my class. You're just not going to come to my classroom and hang out and not have something to say. Oh no. I'm going to be asking you questions too. You invade my space, I'm going to invade your space. How about that? So what are your thoughts on it? What truism do you have for that one? Uh-huh. Yes. Uh-huh, Mrs. Bunker. Yes. Yeah. What's your opinion? What you got? Coming up in my classroom. No! We participate. We're a family. The kids are going to get all different perspectives. From me, from you, and each other. So, you didn't raise your hand. I volunteered you. You didn't volunteer. You were volunteered. <laughs> No, but actually, <laughs> one of the ladies um, who observed the class, she's an expert in truism, so I kind of wanted to hear her perspective on them, too. And yes, honey, the kids did that thing. So now I'm about to design an anchor chart or a big piece of paper where kids, now I'll, I'll present this tomorrow, so we'll continue the truisms and our whole day will be one big truism. 
and the packets that the kids do not finish if you want a grade those packets will go home you got homework and I don't give homework very often now you got homework and you can get your textbook online electronically how about that mm-hmm Bless his heart. This is good. But let me tell you, Lord Jesus, I was tired of the Thanksgiving food. Mm-hmm. I think I got turkey. There's some macaroni and cheese and candy in. <laughs> and sweet potato pie. Hmm. So Mm. It's good, y'all. I'm, I'm just saying, much to eat. Y'all want a bite? Go ahead. You got a bite? Go ahead. Get that bite right there. Go ahead. Go on. All right. Don't say I didn't offer. Don't say I didn't offer, okay? I don't know what's going to happen. I don't know if I'll be able to put that tree up. I don't know. Clinton, my son, you know, I don't talk about him. But I think he got him a little gig. We'll see. He said, I'm going to give you money for for some oil because he's been frying and creating stuff at the house. I'm going to give you money for some more oil and some eggs and stuff. No. You can give me gas money. That's what you can do. How about that? And then Sydney, my daughter, she's going away this weekend with her church. Mmm. Mmm. Child. This is good. Mmm. This is really a treat. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Mr. Daniel. Mmm, 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 mmm. -mm. Because I don't go out to lunch. So school has been in session August for four months. And I think this is the second time I think I had lunch outside of me packing my own lunch. So yes, this is treat for me. This is treat. All right, guys. Let me finish. Let's see how many more minutes is that. Uh, oh, Lord. 12 more minutes. Mm-mm-mm-mm. try to zone down and cherish these last few minutes. Mm. Mm. Alright guys. I'll see you later. What's up Basil Babes? I just made it back home. Oh, what time is it from school? I'm just making it in from school. It is 7 o'clock. I am tired. <laughs> I, am, I am so tired. Uh, Sydney, I don't know where Sydney is. I don't know where Clinton is. Bobby had Bobby's home. So I just finished chatting with her. I'm about to take my clothes off. I tried to keep it kind of Christmassy today. I think the blessing, the beautiful blessing I received at school is going to be it for Vlogmas today, honey. It was still a gift and I appreciated that lunch. Oh my gosh, it was like heaven. So, it's 7 o'clock. You know if I go to bed early, child, I'll be up at 2. <laughs> so, I'm going to force myself to stay up. So, I did get up 
extra early today because uh, with the vlog that you guys received yesterday, I was so tired, I couldn't do it. I could not pull through, so I did get up extra early um, this morning to finish the vlog and stuff. So, so I am going to close out this video. I hope you guys are all doing well. I hope you guys take the time to watch the vlogs when you can and share the vlogs because they do take a lot of time. And I was watching Strong Mommy Chrissy, and she has like 99,000 kids, um, single mom. And she was just like, you know, being a vlogger is so hard. And she has little kids. You know, I have like, I got to drive all my kids around. And she has little kids that really need her through and through. At least I don't got to wipe no booties. Oh, Lord, I'm glad I'm done with that. Lord Jesus, thank you. So, um, and I just, I, I kind of understood, but shh. Her channel just blew up, but I think she was grinding on her channel for years before she crossed over. And she just saying it's so hard and you know, YouTube is her sole income and you know, she's a stay at home mom. So, I mean, I would love to get to that status, but I mean, she got involved in some drama. I, I can't do drama with other YouTubers. It's, it's not what I want to do. Um, but however she got there, she put in her years. And, and I was just watching her and she was saying how it's so hard. She wants to work. She just wants to just sit down and put out the content. But she she she's on a whole nother level than I am. And I'm just like, you know, sometimes I put out a video. I'm like, where are all my 10,000, 11,000 plus subscribers? Where where y'all at? Where you at, boo? Where you at, boo? Where you at, boo? But, you know, putting out these daily vlogs is a lot of work. Um, and just and just in case you guys don't remember, my ears always itch. I have allergies and I don't know if they didn't give me medicine. I, it is what it is. So anyway, um, it's, a, it's a lot of work. And I was like, you know, you put all that work, lose a lot of sleep. You know, you expect and you hope people going to watch your stuff. And sometimes for me, it's discouraging. Did I hear somebody knock on the door? the wash machine oh I'm dreading emailing these people about the wash machine I don't know what they're gonna say the spin cycle gone what are they gonna say I'm gonna email the man see what he says oh I don't feel like dealing with that but you know Bobby and basketball we wash clothes I try to tell the kids we wash clothes once a week um, Bobby made maybe a little more frequently because you know she's in the sports and stuff but she said that spin cycle she says it's real I think something is loose I don't know nothing about no washing machines that I don't know you know I can figure out a lot of things but I can't figure out a washing machine okay I'm not gonna try to tinker with that so I'll send I'll shoot the man an email tomorrow morning about the washing machine so with that said I'm gonna go down I'm really not hungry at all, but I know the later it gets, I'm gonna get a little more peckish. So I'd rather just get in now so my food has time to digest before I go to sleep sleep, so I'm not sleeping on that. I'm too tired to run. Ooh, I haven't done anything this week at all. Zero. Oh well. <laughs> and um, I think I'm just gonna close out here and try to get this little video up for you guys for uh tomorrow so with that said i hope you have a wonderful night be safe out there share the channel share the love and thank you guys for those who are watching and being consistent and commenting and you know you know i appreciate all that and when you get a chance to go back and watch i do appreciate that too so thank you guys for watching so have a good night until next time later